Alright everyone, Semi Neon here, and today we're playing the uh, Scrap and Run Parasites mod with the HBM Nuclear Tech mod installed. So let's get right into it, shall we? First things first, we want to collect some items here, and uh, here, let me find a... Hmm. Let me see if I can find a uh, village or something. Or anything, really. Some sort of civilization. Oh lordy. The English is not Englishing already today. <laughs> Very tired. And honestly, this is like a spur of the moment kind of thing. Because, like, um, I was going to uh, rebuild my oil refinery from our building competition a long time ago. If anybody remembers that with Savage Vegeta and uh, whatever, whatever his name was. I don't know how to pronounce it anyway, so it's... Yeah. But, anyway. So, anyway, things are going to start happening. So, our main goal right now is to at least find some civilization. And if we can't find any civilization, at least build a house. So we can at least, like, survive just a little bit longer. I don't, honestly don't think we're going to survive long enough to actually advance into the XBM nuclear tech mod tree. This is supposed to be a hundred days. Um <laughs> be lucky if I make it to like five. Ten maybe if we're lucky. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go ahead and get some wood here. Um is uh it seems like we're not gonna oh what the heck. I just slightly moved and um don't do anything weird, okay there, bud? Dang it. <laughs> Alright, we should be situated now. Hopefully. I don't know what that was, but that already sounded pretty scary. Sounds like that was, that's a zombie. It. Here he is. Alright, well, let's get out of here. <laughs> Oh lordy, this thing's already, um, happening. Should we build our, like, a little house on an island or something? I feel like that'd be a good idea. Honestly, because, like, you know, either that or in the air. Because I've seen videos of, uh, I've seen For Forge Lads playthrough of this. So I kind of know what to expect, at least, so at least we have some prior knowledge to, uh, you know, either use to our advantage or not, as the case may be. Oh, I need a one single berry. Can't eat that, unfortunately. That's unfortunate. Alright, we've got a mushroom over here. Interesting, interesting. Some civilization would be nice. A village, maybe. You know. Dad. <laughs> oh, goodness. I don't know what kind of biome this is, but it lo doesn't look like a very fun one. That's right. <laughs> we don't have vein mine. <laughs> oh, no. I, you know, I often forget how much I use vein mine. Like honestly, it's not that I really need it or anything. It's just simply that I'm too impatient to actually like chop stuff down or mine stuff. It's the peak ADHD moment right there. All right, I think our goal is not to unalive anything. Because that will make the monsters, um, the parasites, progress faster, I think? I'm not really sure. Like I said, I'm not exactly an expert here. I just watched a couple of, um, Forge Labs is 100 days a long time ago. I was going to do this a long time ago, but, like, I kind of forgot about it. Got pushed to the back burner, if you will. It do happen quite a lot. Alright, that is nothing helpful to us. We have a portal over here? Okay, that's, uh... <laughs> that's funky. 
Um, hmm. Should I go in? Might as well, right? That's funky. I wonder if there's any parasites in the nether. <laughs> What's up with that? Like, just like out here. We gotta get some food, honestly. Oh, oh, oh. Word. Fortress. Um, I probably forgot to turn off the radiation damage in the config. So I probably shouldn't stick around here too long. I'm just gonna do a little sprinty sprint around here. There's nothing in here that's useful to me anyway. <laughs> but that is freaking neat, low key. Interesting. Ow. Yeah, very smart. Very smart. Alright, well, that is something. Oh, you know what? I would save that on my mini-map, except I don't have one, so we're gonna have to actually do it the old-fashioned way of actually saving things. Okay. Um... That's funky. Alright, I have no idea which way I have no idea which way we're going, so we're just heading this way. There appears to be something over here. Underwater too. Interesting. Ooh, oh, that's a nice little house. If whatever's under the water is not good, I'm certainly going in that. A nice little house. Let's see here. Oh, this is a rogue dungeons kind of thing, isn't it? Fuck. That's what that's what it is. I that's that's probably what the house is too. Well, it's our closest thing to a house, and I'm kind of starving to death too, so can't really be too perticky. <laughs> perticky. I honestly feel like I just make out words sometimes because I'm just so uh uh, special. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna go down to the basement and see what's down here. Uh, I hope it's nothing bad. Take over there. Bunch of weeds and stuff over here. Interesting. Very interesting. Alright, we're going to get some better tools first. Yeah, vantage point start whacking people if I need to. I don't know what I was trying to make with that, really. There we go. This might probably this will probably be the death of me, honestly. A lot of playthroughs end like this. <laughs> Dimension, we're like directly underground, which is like the place we shouldn't be. More than one spider. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Really? Yeah. I thought that was a creeper, I'm not even gonna lie. Let's turn some lights on around here, it's too dark.
Hmm. Interesting. I don't think it even worked. Oh, it did. Barely. Okay, look at that. We're getting some armor and food, even. We're balling. Alright, I'm gonna make a sword, uh, actually. I feel like that'd be a smart idea, considering that to be uh, kind of spooky out here. This is going to be our main hub here. Oh, how cute. Mm -hmm. Wow, son of a bitch. Skip. Let you drop your shield. I should have crafted that sword. Well, that it really doesn't help, actually, because, you know... It's just, just slowly progressing the virus, parasite, whatever. I don't know why I keep saying virus. It's a parasite, isn't it? Regardless, I am not a, like, biologist, so... <laughs> parasite, you know, whatever. <laughs> All right, let's let's get some bread here. Or not literally. This is completely a bad idea. Weird. What is this? Torch. Hmm. Interesting. A room. Probably definitely not enough torches. Ooh, look at all this fun stuff. Some books. Tiles in the game. Efficiency. Beetroot. Yeah, beetroot. You know, honestly, what would make this mod harder would be if it had the uh, tough as nails mod installed. It'd just make things just unenjoyable. I also don't know why that's not in here, actually. Alright, I think we've looted everything that we can safely loot without getting our heads chopped off. Let me see if there is another level before I continue, though. There's one of those parasites already. It's a level one, I think. Just because we did that, we've kind of escalated our problem just a little bit more. We're very good at it. We're very good, actually. <laughs> very good. What the heck? This looks like a trap, but like... Oh, I hate the sound of that. I'm starting to exist, you know. <laughs> Hear that? Yeah, that's that's our problems existing right there. All right, let's grab some bone meal. Of course, we're gonna need a lot of bone meal. Genetic armor, huh? That's pretty interesting. Get rid of that. Yeah, I don't feel like writing any poems today. I'll take the name tag though. Ooh, yeah, look at that. That's a an evolved form of that thing that we just unalived earlier. That's so cool. That's so great. We shouldn't really be down here. That's so wow, yes, wonderful. That is so fucking slay. I'm gonna go this way. I am going to go to the surface. See, the thing is, the uh, virus uh, infection... <sighs> yep, okay. <laughs> I see enough MLP horror AUs to know what's going on. Okay, yep, and we've pretty much... We have gotten lost. <laughs> oh, that's so fun. Love that. Okay, I think we came out this way. We dare go down another level. Yep, nope. That is no for me, dog. 
<sighs> okay, let's get the let's get the Honda out of here. Hall of the High Three. That's so cool. That's not good. That is so not good, chat. Oh lordy. Hmm. Mm. I think we've progressed our problems just a little bit quicker than things should be progressing. That's so fucking loud. No, it's so damn neat. Um, hmm. Well, let's, uh, sprint. I don't know what the freak that all is going on. Oh my god. No. That is absolutely fucking terrifying. Oh my god. Oh lord Jesus. I think I just gave myself tachycardia. That is terrifying. What the freak? Freaking holy Honda pilot. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I think I've just given myself tachycardia. <laughs> that was not um what I was expecting at all. Um hmm. Honestly, I don't know where to go at this point. Cause like things are progressing way quicker than I had ever envisioned. It's only been day one, hasn't it? Like um, like, I'm not, I'm not nearly ready enough for this. That's the problem. That is so the problem. I'm not nearly ready enough, or ready enough for this. Okay, well, this looks like a little... There's things in the water! That's so fucking cool. That's really not, actually. I don't know what that swimming thing is, but I don't want to deal with it. Okay, yes. We love the Eldritch Horrors. We love them. Oh, lordy. Uh, I don't know where to go. That's the fun part. I think I'm just going to keep moving. If I keep moving, I shouldn't... I'm not even going to say I shouldn't perish. Because, you know, at this point, I don't even know. Because things are already escalating well beyond my mental understanding. Light over here. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Okay, let's see. Um, please be something that's well fortified. Looks like a village. I guess that's good, actually. If we get it up there without getting our freaking legs chopped up, that'd be great. Okay, let's see. My boat. Hey, my boat. Thank you. We could just get inside without meeting Jesus. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, I'm pretty sure prob that probably attracts... I... Well, apparently we have more than just mutated creatures to worry about. I guess they are kind of mutated in their own special little way. They're supposed to be pigs at some point. Yeah, that's another Rogue's Dungeons, isn't it? Frack, I just came up here for no reason. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's so great. <laughs> I don't really talk this much, but since I'm stressed, I feel like I'm just talking more. Can we find something that's like, you know, not a harbinger of freaking disaster and disease and parasites? Great, thank you. Okay, yes. We love that. We so love that. That's so fucking slay. That's so fucking slay. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, and we have sharks, and whatever those weird little, uh, whatchamacallits are. There's too many things that can kill me already. And I'm not even good at playing vanilla hardcore Minecraft. <laughs> and yet we're out here, aren't we? Sort of trying to survive, anyway. So, anyway, I'm gonna need a strategy, because, um... Yeah, things have escalated outside of my control already. Right? You love that. I need a village. I really need a village. Or, like, a, a fact, any HBM building right now would be absolutely fantastic. Honestly, what a factory. Get, like, bricks and stuff. The floor is reinforced. Or, you know, it's at least bricks or cobblestone. It's, I think, actually, I think it's cobblestone. That's that could be improved, but like bricks are pretty nice. And yeah, the scaffolding and stuff. Honestly, even if I couldn't use it, I could just loot it. 
Hmm, this has turned into a difficult situation. What is this weird looking thingy over here? I swear if it's another one of those rogue dungeons, I'm gonna sh hmm. Sure, dang well, this is not son of a biscuit. I don't want another rogue dungeon. I don't want another in house adventure. I'm bringing a certain Zubal vibe to the establishment. I feel like I've been here, honestly. It's because all the biomes look the same. There's nothing out here so far. Whatever is going on at spawn, though, is just diabolical. Ooh, wow. Okay, um, we're gonna have to get out of this area. This is just slowing me down. I need to find something, something, a structure, even. An abandoned house. Wowzers, that's so cool. That's not exactly what I was looking for, but I, you know. Biscuits. Okay, well, this is in pretty bad shape, like. That's another one of those weird things over there. We have apples. That's lit. An actual apple. That's so fucking cool. That is literally the coolest thing, chat. When the apple trees grow up, or when the oak trees grow apples. That's so fucking lit. That is literally the most freaking cool thing. Is that a pear? Heck yeah, we ball it hard. Alright, well this looks a little more, uh, happy, you know. I hate to see how it is during nighttime, but, you know. I don't plan on sticking around for the nighttime. Okay, well, what do we have here? Oh yeah, we can't mine that, because that's going to give us lung cancer. I wish I was joking about that, but, like, actually. That will give us lung cancer. Or a black lung, anyway. Which, you know, honestly, probably eventually leads to lung cancer. Mesothelioma. Oh, I think that's the bestest, actually. Which I is certainly in this mod, too. In the, in the HP of Nuclear Tech mod, I should be more specific. <laughs> oh, man, I'm dying. It looks like we got a bundle of stones over here. Abandoned house or weird structure. Oh, look at this. What is this? <laughs> Neat. Not so neat. Toxic trait is saying "yowch" when I get it, whenever I get injured in Minecraft. I think that might have exploded. Oh, might as well make our problems worse, right, chat? Yep, I think I'm gonna have to retreat. I don't even know what that was. All I know is we got twelve torches from it. I guess that's good. You know, that's something. Just here, actually. <laughs> Interesting. 
I really miss having a map. Honestly, because, like, I can find out which direction I'm going. And, you know, avoid going back to the same spots that I've been at. But the Minecraft gods have not blessed us with a mini-map this time. There's frogs here. That's pretty lit. I'm just, like, barreling through their homes. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I wonder, if they're, I wonder if they're actually frogs or if it's just, like, frog noises. I haven't seen a single frog. It's a conspiracy, almost. More importantly, can the frogs get infected by the uh, parasite? That's truly the big question we have to ask ourselves. Alright. Apparently we're not going to find any house, village, or anything like that. So, um... Hmm. Hello there. It's a dog. Coyote, maybe. We're gonna have to make. A, we're gonna have to make a base, basically. Which I I didn't want to do. Honestly, I hate building. I'm like building's gonna be even more difficult now because I have to build to keep out getting like parasites and stuff, which is not fun. Well, I don't know what this is, but we could use this. It's just like a pillar of stone. <laughs> All right, well, you know, that's that's something helpful. Interesting. All right, I guess, you know what? Now we're going to end this here, and um, I don't have anything to make a bed, do I? That's going to be problematic. We should have been working on that instead of hunting for, you know, structures. What the heck with all these foxes over here? Five foxes. A whole bunch of uh, more furry looking things. <gasps> Ooh, okay, look at that. We have a freaking factory over there. Now we're talking. It only took to the end of. Oh, loud. Now everything's showing up after I was about to end my freaking video. That's so nice. That's so wonderful. I think a corrupted broadcaster might be around here too. Guarantee it's probably close to the uh, factory. So the Minecraft gods are entirely not in our favor. Alright, well, we have this luxurious looking place. What the has a bed? Ooh, okay. Alright, now we're, now we're freaking talking. That's. Isn't that like really fucking rare? That's fucking lit. All right, give me the, all that coffee. I'm gonna need it because um, <laughs> I got demons I'm fighting. Okay, look at that. That's fucking tight. That's some pipe shit right there. Hey, boy, I got some coffee. Alrighty, well, that's going to be it for this uh, video, guys. If you liked it, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.